Hello, with this video I want to show you how you could play the DOS game, the ZLOS 2, on current operating systems like Windows Vista, Windows 7 or Windows 8 or Windows XP. And at first, before we start the DOS box, DOS box we take a look on the CD from the game. And here we have the install batch file. We need this file to uh, do the, the installation of the game. And before we start the DOS box, please make sure that you have created the folder DOS in your hard drive C. Okay, let's start. We start the DOS box. At first, we mount the Hard drive C with the folder DOS. Mount C DOS. Then we mount the CD ROM drive. If you're CD-ROM drive did not have uh, the letter D, you must change this letter uh, and change it for instance to um, E, F or G, otherwise it will not work. Now we uh, change the drive to CD-ROM and with the command D colon and now we start the installation with the command install. Okay, we start the installation on hard drive C. Okay. Okay, now we have to do the sound setup. At first, uh, the MIDI driver. We choose Creative Labs Sound Blaster or 100% compatible. Okay. And now the Digital Audio driver. And there we choose the Creative Labs Sound Blaster Pro or 100% compatible too. Okay. Sound setup is done. Now we could quit the program. Okay. Also, we could run the game straight away. Let me show you one more step first. A set of commands you will need to start the game next time with DOSBox. So we close the DOSBox and start it again. At first we mount the hard drive. The CD-ROM drive. Then we change the drive to um, the hard drive. We go to the folder blue byte. Then to the folder set settler 2. And then we could start the game with uh, command settler 2. Board book of Octavius, captain of the Tortius. The morning entry for the twelfth day in the month of Mars in the fourth year of the godlike emperor Travianus Augustus Caesar. Okay, the game is working. Now let's start a free game. The Dark Path. 